Hi, everybody. It's Mark Rushton of markrushtongallery.com. It is Friday afternoon, April 8th, 2022. And um, this video is, uh, well, we'll get to that in just a second here. Uh, we always start off with every daily video with the uh, the Mark Rushton Instagram picture of the day. I'm out at, at Mark Rushton. And uh, we're holding steady there at 105 followers. Be nice. It'd be nice to get a, a little bit of a, more of an army out there, but that's all right. So uh, some some of the recent pictures here and videos and and things like that. Of course, every picture has a story, doesn't it? Yes, it does. And so this one here is um, uh, uploaded one of my uh, fast videos, and there's music on it too as well. Uh, I'm not playing the music here. I'm not including the. Um, audio from my computer which i actually cannot hear but uh just kind of want to run through the video here it's i think it's about 50 52 seconds something like that and uh this is patched lands this is available in my uh print store and the music on it is hyperloop which is an old disquiet hunto piece that i made many many years ago and it's it's absolutely appropriate for uh for this and uh working on that there and then I think I think we're almost done here. Just gonna kind of smooth it out a little bit there, and there we go. There we go. Just a little last touch there, and there it is. Patched lands. Uh, prints available at markrushtongallery.com. Does it repeat? Of course it repeats. You can watch it over and over and over again. <laughs> I tried to. I tried to. I, we're gonna stop this here. I tried to upload this to, to TikTok, and my God. Oh, TikTok can be such a pain. It, it really can be such a pain. So let's get to the main part of this very short video here. And uh, this this video is called Hugh Lifson uh, opening at the Hudson River Gallery tonight. And so Hugh Lifson, I believe he's now retired as a uh, art professor at, at Cornell College in Mount Vernon, Iowa. And a uh, fantastic artist. He's got an opening tonight at the Hudson River Gallery and Frame Company, 501 12th Avenue, Suite 3, Coralville, Iowa. So it's right at the corner of 5th Street and 12th Avenue in Coralville. Just, you know, it's like five minutes away from my house, maybe seven. I don't know, depending on how many green lights I hit. And uh, yeah, I haven't been to a gallery in a uh, couple of years, you know, because so uh, hopefully this will be this will be a cool event uh, tonight. Six to eight p.m. is the opening. I plan to swing by, you know, uh, probably in between that period of time. Just take a look at here. And, you know, you can go out and look at the show online if you're not in the Iowa City area. And he does um, very, very interesting and unique paintings. And let's take a look at some of these here real quick. So he has this sort of technique where he, I think he mainly paints, paints in acrylic. And then he uses this, uh, let's, uh, it's like saran wrap. And it's just, I've never seen anybody do anything like this. And I've, I've been watching his paintings here for the last, can't encounter them here in the last 20 years, particularly when I was in Cedar Rapids. He stopped by a show that I was in in 2004 and he, he had very kind words for my paintings. And uh, and then uh, one time I went on an art tour in, in Mount Vernon many, many years ago. And he was not young then. <laughs> And he had his house open. You could kind of see where he was doing his work down in, I think it was in his basement, if I'm not mistaken. And just wonderful person, wonderful person. And uh, I, I'd love to get one of his someday. I see these around all the time. In the, uh, you know, the uh, one time I was at like a hospital clinic or whatever. And I'm like, ah, it's a Hugh Lifson. I, I, I know that from anywhere, right? Let's, let's, let's keep going here real quick here. So you just kind of get a flavor of what this is like. And then I, apparently he's got like a bunch of drawings in here as well. And if we can, uh, those might be a little more difficult to see on the screen or whatever. So, uh, you know, kind of can't wait to see those in person. I think there were some more down here. Again, this is very representational of his, his painting style. He's been like this for some time. It's, it, it's, it looks wet. And then it's got that saran wrap and it's it's on canvas and he uses just a, a simple wood frame on it. And I can't wait to see these. He's a, he's just amazing. Just love his stuff. I'd love to get one someday. And uh, 
So anyway, that is at the Hudson River Gallery and Framing in 501 12th Avenue, Suite 3, Corville, Iowa. I plan to go there tonight and take a look at some art. And and yeah, remember back in the day when you when you go to art openings and stuff like that? It's a wonderful place. Wonderful. I've been in there before. Um, anyway, and then after that, I'll get home and uh, we will do live art show number five. And look at this. I've got a painting. Just one painting. I got one painting already in the weekly sale up here. So, so that's great. And uh, just put in an order for some tote bags, some magnets, and then also a metal print with a different type of backing that's uh, uh, all fulfilled by my fulfillment vendor. Those will probably be here in the next week and a half or so. And uh, I'm totally looking forward to those. You know, I'm, I'm actually having a tote bag made up of which, which one? I think it's 1 a.m. still at it. If I'm not, or maybe it's plot. Maybe it's this one. Maybe it's winter break. Anyway, uh, one of them is definitely, um, yeah, it's winter break. So I'm going to, I'll be going into stores with my shopping bags and they will, you know, they will look like this, right? Can you imagine me going into a store with a shopping bag like that? And then there's one other here. There's one other here. I think it's a uh, tree companions. Let's go over here to tree companions. Somewhere down the list here. Where's Tree? There's Tree Companion. That was the other one that I got the uh, the tote bag on. Just because they're so colorful and vibrant. And a tote bag, yeah, $23.95 plus shipping. I mean, look at that. I want to see what these look like in real life. I it, They're like, they have like three different sizes. 13 by 13, 16 by 16, and 18 by 18. So I got a, I got a big one and I got a medium one. But I just think like that sort of bag right there. That's like a conversation starter. Like, where did you get that bag? Who made that bag? And you know what I need to do? You know what else I need to do? Yes, you know what I need? I need to, I need to get some new business cards made up. So I'm going to have to do a Vista print here very sh shortly and hopefully get those uh, get those eventually too. And and, and a new, uh, what's the, the, the barcode, the, uh, the QR code, right? Because I like to have a very simple, uh, simple, um, business card with everything like that so that way if somebody sees me walking around with these bags what are these bags what are these bags that you have right because i'm just going to be every store i go to i go to natural grocers like three or four times a week and that's 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 my main grocery store and so i, I would think that everybody there particularly the help are just going to be like what is this what is it? tell me this story right or you go into uh you know uh i i, I don't know Joanne or Michaels or something like that. And I got my bags with me to put my stuff in, but they are so unique. That's got that's got to be a conversation started, right? And then it's like, hey, here, here, you know, I have a card right here. You you can order this bag yourself. Not that much. And then of course the magnets too. I I did not get this one in a magnet, but I got some others in magnets. So we'll all be showing those off here real soon. Anyway, don't want this video to be too long, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Good to go see, uh, good to go see Hugh Lifson tonight. Uh, this and that, whatever that's called. And, uh, uh, you know, I won't see you there, but, uh, uh, I'll probably talk about it on the live show. of the uh, the next few days anyway that's it for that's it for now see you in a few hours talk to you later bye